Huh, why is the stadium part in the middle of the maze? That's a little bit weird. And shouldn't this be at night? Or is that just in the film? Huh, I should know that. So, the maze. Well, the period, I think I have to go... Yeah, it looked like I had to go one step forward, but uh, are there actually anything here? No, I can't go here. So, well, it's great, great to get an overview like this. Makes it seems much more easier. So, this appears to be a dead end, so let's go back. And I can't go up there. Or I could go there, but that not really a wise choice. What about this? Oh, this looks good. Wait. Do these beads actually point me in the right direction? That seems kind of silly. <laughs> that defeats the entire purpose of a mace. Okay, so let's see here. Right isn't good, and left just keeps keeps sending me back around. So let's try right. Could go for the like touch the left wall of the maze to find your right way, the right way. But I don't really have time for that, and I don't think you would like to watch that either. So. Well, this looks like the right way. And we were just failed by Robert Patterson. Run! And we have to run from this thing. Great. Left or right, left or right, left or right. Right. Oh. Got hindered there a bit. It's slalom, baby. Well, it appears that didn't matter, matter so... Take right again. It appears to be any difference, so... Well, that sucks. Now we got hit by the thing that's following us. Okay. Well, up here we're near at the end. At least of this gauntlet thing. Well, the path, ha the path hasn't been divided sometimes, so I take that as a good sign. Yeah, and this is also a good sign that, like, everything is trying to stop us by now. There you go. Phew. Hurry. <laughs> Didn't appear to be connected by anything. Oh no, yeah. Forgot about those. How did I defeat those again? It wasn't just by spamming spells. Well, let's just do that. Well, I think I'm going to die quite a few times here. And I can't even see myself, so yeah. Shouldn't it? It's back and breathe. Yeah. Ah, I see. Genius. So, if I just stand here and wait for it to charge. Oh, seem to predict my move. Well, well played, well played. Come on, charge me! 
There we go. And... It's dead! Of course... Or it just turned into bubbles. So now I guess he considers us even, so... Yeah. Silver. Now I can face Voldemort. Let's drink to that. Delicious Red Bull. Well done, let's finish this game. It's been long enough. Yeah. Cedric, get back to the cop. Uh oh. Now! I'm not leaving you. Kill the spare. No! The Cadavra! Harry. Oh, that sucks. The boy who lived. Robert Pattinson's no longer with us, and we will be Lucia. reborn as a vampire shortly, and then become a part of horrible, on, horrible part of books. You have up your sleeve. And even more horrible films. I'm going to you. So I do know how to how to defeat him. But first, I have to throw skeletons. Ah, oh, like this. So I could just smash it against something. No. Well, I can jinx them, so doesn't really matter. It's the same all as we had done the whole game, just spam the spells. But in the end, there's actually a new twist to the gameplay. Or at least what you have to do to defeat the boss, which is, of course, Voldemort. Yeah, if only we haven't killed him. <laughs> You'll have to do better than that, Harry. Better than what? Killing your skeletons? I seem to own them quite hard, so don't really know what you're talking about. I and he seems to be invincible. Oh, there's one more. That's why the next part of the fight didn't start. Come on. Oh, another skeleton. 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 Can't even talk. As per usual. Hmm, but there is a cauldron here. Hmm. That can't be what I had to do. No. So, just killing it. Well, well, your filthy muggle mother would be proud. No! I want to see the light leave your eyes. Yeah. Don't you turn your Havada Kadam! Finally! So, this was the thing I was talking about. You basically have to just. Basically, just have to steer this thing around and make sure it doesn't hit you and defeat your enemies with it because it seems to be quite powerful. Huh. This seems to be a bit harder than I remember. Just go to a kind of safe place and there we go. 
bow to death, Harry. Bow for death. Well, the spell doesn't seem to hurt me. That's great. That's really great. So, what I really have to do is destroy the statue using the spell. Which I'm doing now, as you see. So, like, I have to do that several times as per usual, and then. Well, that didn't stick. Now it's stuck. <laughs> it just looks silly. Oh well. Fitting end to this game. And I think I'm done. The game is over. Finally. Well, think so at least. Yeah, it appears to be so. Yeah. So, I do believe we get to end the cutscene now, so I will let you enjoy it, and I will thank you for, um, for seeing my walkthrough, and if you liked it, subscribe, if you're not already subscribed, and do remember to hit that like button, and I'll see you in the, in the next walkthrough. Bye. No matter how convincingly you tell the story of what happened tonight, few will believe that Voldemort has returned. But tell the story you must.